Hello and welcome back to the channel. As you all know, rapid urbanization has resulted in changing the lifestyle of people. People spend more now and they lead a busy lifestyle. They prefer calling someone for tasks like house cleaning and repair services instead of waiting in the traffic. People like to book home services on their smartphones. It is anticipated that the global home services market will reach USD 1574.86 billion in 2024. It shows that we will see more startups venturing into the home service business. On demand home service app is one of the easiest way to bring your business online. It helps generate more revenue by attracting more users. So in this video you will see the features and functionality of a very smart admin panel for home service platform. So without further ado let's get started with the video. What comes to mind when we hear the word dashboard? Of course the all in one visibility of all the vital information that the admin requires. So in this section the admin can view the total number of users, service providers, bookings, earnings, category and service. The admin can also keep a check on monthly and weekly earnings. User management the admin can now review and manage the information of all its users slash customers by making changes to the existing information and deleting a user. The admin has complete control over the customers and can block and unblock them anytime. We also provide the admin with an export CSV option which allows the admin to export the entire data in the form of an Excel sheet. Using the search tab, the admin can search a specific user. Before moving to the provider section, let me give you a brief overview on providers. A provider is basically a seller who contributes services in the business. So there would be providers on the panel that would be added by the admin. Admin would be able to view all the details of the providers, block and unblock them accordingly. He or she can use the filters to approve and unapprove the providers. By clicking on the add provider button, the admin would be able to add the provider details. He has to fill all the fields and hit the save button. Now using the search tab, the admin would be able to search the service providers. He or she can also take action by editing or deleting a specific provider. Now next we have category. The admin can view, add and manage the category. We have also given the ability to the admin to delete and edit the existing category by clicking on the add category button the admin would be able to add a new category by choosing the image and writing the name now using the search tab he or she can search for a specific category let's move on to managing services from here the admin can add a service by choosing the image entering its name and selecting the category the admin has the ability to enable and disable the service, edit as well as delete it. Using the search tab, he or she can search for a specific service. One of the excellent features we offer is the ability for admin to view the bookings using the start and end date filter. He or she can also check the status of the bookings. He or she can review the bookings through order ID, username, provider name, service, start date, completed date, total amount, tax, commission, price type, status and can further click on a cancel button to take any action. Using the search tab, the admin would be able to see the
the specific booking and can also reset the screen by clicking on the reset button. Let's discuss about contacts. This is the section from where the admin can view and search the contacts of the users and can also check the type whether they are subscribed or not. Now, under the suggestions section, the admin would be able to view the suggestions provided by the service providers. He or she can see the suggestions and can make the changes to the existing service accordingly. Using the search tab, they can search for a specific suggestion. Next, we have the section to manage CMS pages. If you are looking for a feature where you can manage the about us, privacy policies, terms and conditions, and many more CMS pages, this is the best platform for you. You can add, delete, and change the same from here, and it will be reflected accordingly on the website under the footer section. Last but not the least, let's move on to the commission section. Using the add commission button, the admin would be able to add the commission. He has to fill the required details, which is written under here, like minimum amount, maximum amount, commission, and has to enable the status and can hit the save button to save it further. Now, the admin can also search using the search tab for a specific commission and can delete and edit the existed commission from here. That was all about the home service platforms admin panel. And as you can see, it was extremely simple to use. So if you plan to launch your own home service platform, I recommend that you click on the link in the description and assist us in getting this panel ready for your business. You can also email us at sales at the rate appunix.com or DM us on our social media accounts. Do not forget to like, comment, subscribe and press the notification bell to stay up to date on new videos. Thank you.